ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to part two of Sonic R. We're taking, we originally took on the prototype, so why not take on the actual final build of the game? It's for the Saturn, by the way. You know, the one that nobody likes? Now, how, now what could be said about this game that hasn't been sent before? It has buggy graphics, crappy controls, doesn't feel like a Sonic game. And also, it feels like a complete terrible racing game from the beginning. The text screen looks really bizarre. It's also your save system, by the way. Also, yeah, that, yeah, that's the difference that I was talking about in the prototype. And they start going to be getting all the characters, all the Chaos Emeralds, and they'll be showing you the character, the unlockable characters in, in their each own part. So, this is Resort Isle Island. Wait, 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 stop it, stop it, you forgot to talk about the story. Wait, Rick? Rick, what the hell are you doing here? Uh, I'm here to help you with Sonic R. Oh, uh, yeah. Yeah, you see, back then, we, we actually were working on a video, a less review for Sonic R, and we, we did it together for Rick's first appearance. But we actually... Deleted and that was on YouTube for a short period of time, but we actually deleted the video. Video. The reason why we deleted it was because we didn't. It wasn't because we didn't hate it. It was because someone accidentally called me in the middle of the recording, and I only noticed that until like, like, seconds after I posted my video, and I had to delete it because if I didn't, I would be doc. I would be risking my um. I would be risking someone knowing um my someone's phone number, and I didn't want to put them at risk. And Rick decided to come back, actually, because I'm reviewing Sonic R. A remake of it. So, Rick, what do you want me to tell oh, them? The story. Oh, yeah, the story. Um, why don't you take it? Because you played the Saturn before. You played this game on the Saturn before. Yeah. Well, here's the story. So... Um, there's a, there's this Grand Prix, which is what Sonic is running through, and Sonic was skeptical about it at first, when Tails saw him, saw it with him, and with Tails wanting him to do it with him, but when he saw Eggman, he was eager to do it, because it was featuring Eggman. Eggman, uh, the whole race was actually a trap to, um, get the Chaos Symbols, because there are, the seven Chaos Symbols were actually scattered through the map. So, Sonic and his friends have to get the Cure Emeralds before him. Yeah, that's the basic story. Um, the medals are just basically just for, um, getting unlockable characters. The medals don't, um, change any ending at all. The only reason you would get it is just to get on every character. This, yeah, also, this doesn't feel like a racing game at all. Like, um, one of the the medals in this area has to make you go behind a wall. Now, listen. I know that Sega's trying their best with this, but this is a racing game. There's only going forward in this game. Not exploring like that. And you have to collect all five medals to get it the, it the unlockable characters. And how you get the unlockable characters is just by getting all five medals and, and finishing the race in the top three. Like, in first, second, and third. And that's how it works. Compare the challenge. <gasps> Tails uh, I remember back then when they used to make um these weird stories about him. 
Like it said that the doll was cursed. Uh, did you try? Did you try one of them, actually, Rick? Uh, m no. My brother tried it once. He got haunted for the rest of his life. Wait, a d an average dog life is 16 years. When did he do it? Um, he did it when he was four. Okay, so he was haunted for 12 years? Yeah. He was haunted for 12 years. Yikes. I bet he may have been freaked out. Yeah, he was. Uh, in fact, one time he actually destroyed the game on the Sonic R DVD because it was haunting him. Yeah, I know. It's so bizarre. I'm glad that they fixed most of the problems of the game on the GameCube, which fixed the buggy graphics, the weird controls, as is it? Old and a little bit of everything. Great, we're going as Tails Doll. Just fantastic. This this doll is really slow. How can it beat anyone? I mean, it can't spin dash. It can't do anything good. Yeah, they're, yeah, they're also collecting the chaos and does I think. I, I really, we really don't see them collecting the chaos emeralds because there, there is no because. Oh, this is something that's actually different from the GameCube. Um, on the GameCube, it shows you what emerald you got. In the Saturn. It doesn't. So you just have to make sure that you know that you got them. So, yeah. Oh, no, no, no. I clicked the wrong one. I was thinking just speaking it up. Egg Robo. I guess it is possible for Tails to win, for Tails doll to win. Kind of weird, cause the doll is creepy as all heck. You win. Advantage two. Kills bleeds through contact all month long. Advantage two. That was weird. My body is my fortress. How do I build it? Drop it. <laughs> yeah, we're literally ha Wait to this video. Ready, set, go. I think I forgot what they're gonna be using the extra footage for. This, the Reactive Factory song was actually my favorite song actually. I think put on my awesome music playlist. It's private. It's public on my channel, so you can check it out. Thank <laughs> you. 
Metal Knuckles. Ready, set, go! I'll be right back. Sorry about that. And Tails win! Yay! Oh, by the way, if you're wondering why Eggman is so lock, he's unlockable when he beat the game. And now they're playing as the bonus characters. I don't know why everyone has such an annoying sound when they move. Like, Tails has that weird whooshing sound. So Sonic and other Sonic um and Knuckles has their 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 pampering feet noise. Tails has that weird whooshing sound. Tails doll and Mel Sonic and um Egg Robo just hover. And then Knuckles does the same thing as them. So now they got them. They they were probably just getting the emblems first, and then and they were gonna go get the um others. Now they're also gonna be showing you Amy, which actually they completely ditch actually. Amy's a boring character actually. She just goes around in her car, and along with Eggman, like because she probably too lazy to get exercise. Hey, Amy, get out of your car and run. I mean, Sonic is running. Knuckles running. Tails is running. Even the robots are running. But you're not doing anything. You're just being lazy. Oh, by the way, also the thing that I said from the GameCube, um, it is here. By the way, here I probably made a wrong assumption. If you wonder why the, why the paper track is, is locked, it's because you have to get all the chaos symbols to unlock it. By the way, also I forgot to mention that this game is actually a bit too short. There are only five tracks in the game, which doesn't feel enough. Like imagine buying this game for twenty bucks and you just have to race five laps. That's boring. Couldn't they have made like at least a few more laps? I mean, like. These, like, these little, um, tracks are just short as heck. They're, like, so quick and easy to get through. Like, you can get, you, like, you can get through them in, like, less than 40 seconds. Well, in one lap. Well, in one lap.
Metal Knuckles. The last person that they're going to be using, I believe, is Supersonic for Radiant Emerald. You see, Radiant Emerald has its own two themes. Supersonic Racing for Supersonic, and its own track for other players, including Normal Sonic and the others. The only person that doesn't get it is Supersonic, because he has his own unique one. By the way, the rings are... Oh, by the way, I forgot to talk about this. The Chaos Emeralds are hidden under great ring gates. You have to use your 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 rings to get the Chaos Emeralds. That's how they work. One. Seven emeralds. This is getting back to normal. Okay. Now we unlock Super Sonic. Now we get to Radiant Emerald. Huh. <sighs> I'm glad you didn't do it. What? You know. Ha! You thought I didn't know. You thought I couldn't get past this whole game without talking about the music? Oh, this is gonna be good. Anyway. Anyway. I'm doing fine. I'm doing And I'm a super sonic racer. I keep your feet right on the ground. And you're a super sonic racer. There's no time to look around. And you're a super sonic racer. And you're a super sonic racer. And you're a super sonic racer. There's no time to fire back. Everybody, 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 everybody. Everybody, 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 everybody,
screw you Sega for canceling Sonic Extreme. And screw you Sega for making the 32 act. And screw you Sega for making everything to make everything worse. If you, if you would if I listened to something like making a real thing, if you were if you were actually not going to rush everything out, then maybe you'd still be making consoles to this day. But no, you decided to rush, and now look where you are, making software games for various companies, including Nintendo, which was your rival. What the hell is wrong with you? I mean, tell me, tell me now, Sega. Whoa, 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 whoa! Calm down, man. Calm down. Uh, let me take this thing, okay? Okay. So, yeah, Sonic R. Weird game ever. This is weird. See ya. Well, that's over.